All right, the Harmony Scholarship is named after June Callwood, and every year Harmony receives hundreds of scholarship applications from across the country. In fact, every year the scholarship committee is faced with the tough task of deciding which 10 will get the money. This year, we have seven scholarship recipients joining us this evening. We now ask our partners in Harmony and the scholarship recipients to come up on stage. The first presentation by CIBC to Mayim Abukar. Oh. <laughs> I read Nathan's right, line. Right, okay. Janelle St. Omer, National Manager, Volunteer of TD Bank Financial Group, presenting to Lena Boronikan. All right, Sonia Kunkel, Managing Director of Diversity and Inclusion, Talent Management at BMO Financial Group, presenting to Mesa Hack. Hope I got that right. Christine Williams, District Vice President for Toronto East at Scotiabank, presenting to Arash Kazai. Marilise Rettig, Deputy General Secretary for the Elementary Teachers Federation of Ontario, presenting to Tori Mercier. And Chuck Kwan, Executive Director at Harmony Movement, presenting to the Tamsila Mother of Simi Kaiser. Bernice Carnegie, Executive Director of the Herb Carnegie Future Aces Foundation and also a representative of the Ontario Public Services Union, also known as OPSU, presenting to Anna Maria Quarry. Okay, so once everybody gets on stage, we're gonna scoot off so that we can take a photo of everyone. And if you have someone on stage, feel free to come up and get your picture because it's your best chance. Round of applause to all of our winners and presenters. All right, Victoria Mercier from Paris District High School will now give her remarks on behalf of all of the scholarship winners. So please welcome Victoria Mercier. My name's Tori, and I'm here to talk briefly to you about what being given this scholarship means to me. So all through my high school, I did have a gay-straight alliance and celebrated events such as Pink Day. But having the Harmony Movement come and do a workshop not only helped our school, but middle schools all through our town. It was an eye-opening experience for many young students, along with myself. I witnessed students who once were bullies suddenly change and become activists on equality something I thought impossible. Now receiving this scholarship to me means that making a difference in society, regardless the size of change made, really does not go unrecognized. The fact that there are people generously recognizing and rewarding young students for the great work we've done truly is heartwarming. 
We all thank you dearly, the Harmony Movement and all others, for helping all of us in furthering our education, along with furthering our drive to widen society's lenses on diversity and inclusiveness, and in helping us to be the change we expect to see in our world. Thank you.